hi uh, we are going to see now uh, surface in surface finish tool path there are uh, tool paths available only for the uh, uh, corner strategy uh, pencil tool path and uh, left out tool path this uh, tool path this two tool path only for the uh, corner uh, strategy uh, so corner there is only small radius will be there uh, if you take a small radius tool for machining entire model it will take a lot of your time so that's the reason the people will take a bigger tool and they will machine it uh, whatever the uh, material are there and uh, the left out material on the corner only machined by the uh, either by left over tool path or by the pencil tool path uh, first of all, we will see about the pencil tool path. Uh, we will we'll take on a, a small model for uh, uh, checking this pencil tool path and its applications. So I'll I'll delete whatever the uh, the old tool path which is made here. So one just you can see here the corner is a, it's a purely a 90 degree meeting angle. Uh, so what is uh, the minimum cutter radius is allowed? You can use you select the uh, uh, corner tool uh, for machining. Okay. Mm, for example. Um, and we will make a, a new tool path now just to delete the uh, previously done tool path ok now uh, we will go asymmetric uh, right click and the tool path and we can say finish pencil tool path so now we can select the entire model for the dry surface so now it will now it will check uh, wherever the surfaces are intersecting and it will find these intersection points and uh, edges and it will generate a uh, tool path over so, so in this case i will select the uh, uh, very small tool so remember if you if you take a small uh, tools you uh, need to keep in mind that holding length and uh, and proper spindle speed and feed rate should be given so so what is the corner radius allowed in the machine that is based on that you are need to take the tool now i took a 4 mm dia tool so there definitely there must be 2 mm radius will be there in the model so now you can give the uh, uh, parameters 150 and uh, um, point one is the feed per tooth and uh, plunge rate i can give 500 so i am not giving any stock here i will accept this so in the finish first uh, we will keep a none uh, then we will we'll go on uh, we don't want uh, additional pass only we will see that uh, the tool just pass on the corners let us see how it is so now it will it will generate the tool path on the intersection points now you can see here so wherever that uh, uh, two uh, surfaces are intersecting it generates the uh, tool path so now it is uh, doing the single pass because uh, we have kept a none that is the reason it is giving the single pass so in single if you given uh, single pass means it machines only on the corner so if you feel that if there is a corner little huge material then you can change the number of passes
so i will say number of passes so one passes step over distance i will say 1.25 i kept it let us regenerate so now there is a center pass one pass and the forward uh, forward pass uh, one pass and backward pass one pass so the total three pass will be there so so both the side left hand side and out right hand side you can you can reduce the step over uh, to 0.25 and the number of passes uh, we can keep three pieces uh, ultimate aim is to machine the uh, edges where the material is left out okay uh, uh you can take a bigger tool and machine the entire model so this tool pass is only for machining the corner this is called the pencil tool pass you can ask the question uh so what is this uh, meaning if you switch on all limit what it will do so it mean that it will machine entire model if you say um Uh, but uh, this tool path is meant for only for the corner machining but you can use it for machine entire model also so by switching on the unlimited the entire model get uh, uh, tool path generated on the entire model uh this byte tangy engine angle is 160 to zero means uh, it is for the uh, calculating the intersection uh, angles so that it will search the intersection angle the angle is zero to uh, 165 inside then only it will generate uh, uh, the corner uh, tool path okay so this is all about the pencil tool path uh, You, you can you can use it but a uh, full machining but uh, this is meant for the corner strategy or corner machining tool path okay uh so if you have taken a tender tool and finish the entire model and only the material left out in the corner we can use the pencil tool path very well to finish the entire model okay thank you